enjoying the Jack on the Go show. Okay, forgive me, I got a little dot on my nose. I scratched my nose last night. Didn't realize I marked it up. It itched. What am I going to do? So anyway, um, so we arrived at Chili's to see if they have steak, and they do. So we're going to do a steak board at Chili's. I never think of Chili's as steak. I never go to Chili's for steak. So I go to Chili's for ribs or burgers or salads or something else. I never think steak. Outback, you think steak. Chili's, you think something else. So anyway, we'll see if they do. They got a ribeye. So we're going to check it out. We're going to see if it's worth doing. And if so, maybe uh, more people start coming for the steak. Okay, you know times really suck when there's alcohol on everything. It's not the menu, the specialty menu. Drinks, 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 drink, alcohol, alcohol. You gotta love it. So there's a picture of their steak. There's a big thick cut of uh, ribeye. But I'm probably getting the surf and turf and it comes topped with shrimp and garlic butter. And then I'll give Tammy my sides. So that's probably what I'm ordering right there. So let's wait and see. Okay, so that's what I think of when I think of chilies. Or I think of like a chicken basket with fries or or their appetizers are good too. Is that the Southwest Dangles? Yeah. Those are always good. But that's what I always used to get when I came here. So it looks like we're doing stuff a little bit different. So you can see behind me that nobody's really here. It's uh, about half full of the restaurant. But the thing is, we had to wait for a table because they're shorthanded. That's a little frustrating, but sign of the times. Okay, do me a favor while we're waiting for our food. Go down in the comment section and tell me who you think has the best steak. Alright? Before we try theirs, where do you go when you want a steak? Alright, so it looks like um, the serpent turf, obviously the shrimp with uh, the garlic butter. Can I get a small side plate too? Sure. You're awesome. Thank you. And that's the ribeye. And what do you got over here? This looks really good. It's called a, uh, a quesadilla explosion grilled chicken salad or something like that. Wait, so it's a quesadilla and a salad? Well, you got cheese quesadillas on the, on the side and it's got all the stuff on top with the grilled chicken. Okay, taste the quesadilla for me. Just, just do a quick little dunk and a bite. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I'm sure that's good. Just a cheesecake, yeah. Good. Yep. Just generic. Mm -hmm. Alright. That's kind of an interesting combination. I've never seen them serve quesadilla with salad. It's pretty cool. Alright, let's give this a try. Okay, let's see if that steak's rare. Uh, it looks pretty good. Like medium rare, yeah. Not as thick as longhorns, but I'm not paying as much longhorns either. Now that looks, well, some people may call that medium rare. Look how beautiful that is. How can you complain about eating that? That's gorgeous. Shrimp's a little small. A little bit bigger in the picture. But it's supposed to have garlic butter on it. Lots of garlic. Always do it as rare as I can get it. And that's it right there. Okay, they pulled it off. They did a good steak. I give the steak about probably an A minus. Um, I have to tell you what made the steak amazing here at Chili's, which I never thought they had steak, was the garlic butter. I really like the butter on my steak. Didn't realize that till today. So, they're not the champs. Longhorn still is way better. But it's very enjoyable. 
very flavorful. And it also kind of took on some of the flavoring from the shrimp that was on top. But that's okay, I love shrimp. So everything was good. So congratulations, Chili, for doing a good steak. Um, I may be back for that steak again. That was really good. The butter was spot on. <laughs>